The Dangote Refinery Seaport project is one project I was very excited to be part of. I was able to document the installation of the seaport infrastructure like the buoys that are used to convey some petrochemical uh, produce. Uh, it was an exciting experience for me and I would just like to share some aerial footage from the process. I got there on that very exciting day and basically I had no of what to expect. I was just proactive and happy to be of service. Yes, I got the opportunity to walk around the the work sites. At some point, I thought about the opportunities this would create for Nigeria as a country. It was an exciting project overall, and I look forward to see how it comes out at the end of the day. So, still on the video, still put and. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, 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 we're right here, man. David is an ex exciting guy that actually was my work buddy and we had fun on this together as he was taking still photos and while I did the area documentation of the site. This is uh, Mr. Kurudi, he works for Marine Platforms. Oil and gas and service firm. So we provide them service solutions, RV services, installation of pipelines uh, for the oil and gas sector. So right now, uh, for this Dangote job installation of um, SPM boys offshore, we are picking up the SPM boys. So uh, these are the boys that we use to uh, transport uh, these uh, crude produce actually. So, uh, that we are doing right. So basically, what you are seeing here is a onshore where it works. We have a vessel. So uh, this is sorted for that. Uh, you know, the vessel chartered for this trip. Right now, uh, you can see some things. What you see that I can do, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. And also, if you look to your right, you can see some lights arrayed. So and you can see some people there. So we are doing a boss assembly. We are coupling those things together, assembling those things together offshore, like good offshore, and also be commissioning where we test. Tools are sorted out and ensured that they are safe for operations. They are being documented and recorded, after which they are now replaced or put back into use. This is part of quality assurance that is being taken in order to ensure a safe process. This particular project was demanding in the sense that I had to take extreme caution to, to observe certain protocols. You need to operate your systems in a way that you don't obstruct the actual process of these installations like as you can see in the videos we were able to feel close to these processes that had cranes, that had machines, that had cables moving around. Thank you guys for watching up to this point. If you really like this video, please click the like button and subscribe for more. On my next video, I would like to show you projects I carried out offshore for Pinnacle and Marine Platforms. Stay tuned, subscribe, like and share. See you in the next video.